Nicholas Conservatory is getting ready for thousands of guests to come see their corpse flower. Our own Blake Dietz went to see the plant today, and Blake, they expect it to bloom any day now? Yeah, that's right, Mimi. The conservatory says the 21-year-old plant took its final step to blooming this morning. Now, it's only a matter of hours before its stench attracts thousands to the flower. When people walk through the front door, once this thing opens, you will immediately smell this, and each step closer, it'll become more and more intense. Rockford's Nicholas Conservatory and Gardens boasts an impressive collection of plants, from palms to lilies to ferns. But none of those will be responsible for drawing thousands to the conservatory this week. That honor goes to Titan Arum, better known as the corpse flower. Conservatories, known affectionately as Grimace, is about to bloom. Today, the actual outer uh, bract has fallen. The bract is what holds the entire flower structure into place. Once that bract falls, it's usually between two and five days, uh, and then the flower will actually open. Now, that could be tomorrow, that could be five days from now. We don't know. It's like having a baby. We know the baby's coming, but we don't exactly know when. The corpse flower is native to just a single Indonesian island and can take up to 20 years before first blooming. But according to conservatory operations manager Clayton Guler, a smellier reason draws people and other animals to its bloom. The biggest fascination is its large structure and size uh, and the fact that once it blooms, it smells like rotting meat or rotting flesh and that is what actually is what attracts pollinators in to pollinate it so that smell is dispersed out and when it is opening up and in bloom this thing can heat up to over 100 degrees fahrenheit inside grimace is also unique its purple center is a rarity among corpse flowers and with its bloom lasting only two to three days the conservatory says to get ready if you want a chance to take it in for yourself we will have lines we will have queuing um, people can go ahead and purchase pre-purchase tickets online ahead of time that way they don't have to wait at the door you've got to try it once and you can say you've done it so the conservatory has set up a live stream to watch for grimaces bloom in real time a link to that and information on how to pre-purchase tickets can be found on our website, mystateline.com. Mimi. All right. Thanks, Blake.